But first, it's that time on a Friday evening in August when we leave our studio and head out on the latest of our Festival Friday series. This evening, Polly and Rob are live at Eastbourne Airborne. What's the atmosphere like, you two? I have to say, John, the atmosphere is great. There's loads of people here. <laughs> You've joined us at a very opportune moment when the American F-16 has just come over for the first time. It was nice and quiet a couple of minutes ago, but now it's very noisy indeed. Well, this is also a really big deal for Eastbourne, and Rob is finding out now what it actually means for tourism in the area. And here, of course, is a Hawk jet, such as the Red Arrows will be using. Now, Neil Stanley is from Eastbourne Council. You're very pleased to see an awful lot of people here today, aren't you? It's a fantastic atmosphere here. The seafront is heaving and everyone is here having fun. Now, this is hugely important for the town, isn't it? Because this four days is worth something like 10% of the town's income. It's worth about £27 million to the town. And, of course, it gives us the coverage. It puts us right on the map and gets people coming to Eastbourne for the first time. And hopefully they'll come back. Now, a couple of years ago, you charged for this event and the numbers fell off dramatic. So you've gone back on that. But can you actually afford to run this at a loss, particularly with the economic situation we're in at the moment? Well, the people we work with, the hoteliers, the business people in the town, they tell us it's worth the investment. And I'm listening to them, and it certainly is, as far as I can see. And it's busy today. I know you're going to do a, a lot of business. Something like 35,000 ice creams are sold over the weekend. That's right. Those ice creams are stretching for miles along the seafront. The seafront is absolutely heaving here. It's been a fantastic day out. OK, Neil, thank you very much. Thank you very... Just come down from the main arena down here to the seafront, and this is where loads of people have gathered to see the uh, aerobatic shows going on above the sea. Now, this is a festival on a massive scale. There's 100,000 visitors over four days. For that. But we shall leave you now with some images of what's been a fantastic day here in Eastbourne. Into the sky.